Hey guys, I just wanted to show you briefly uh, some of this Hymn for the Weekend by Coldplay. This music video which I believe was released around the time of the Super Bowl with Beyonce in it. And it's pretty interesting to expose in regards to just showing you how this agenda is pretty consistent uh, across the board with this whole cracking open the projector, this false reality that's uh, that they're bringing to earth and how Beyonce playing the Queen of Heaven this Lady Fatima, Queen of Heaven figure, being part of this projection. You see she's even on a projector screen here in the cinema. So I can't really show you too much because of copyright, but it's it's just, just to give you another example, really, that she's coming from this fractal place with the peace sign, so the false peace sign across her face there. And... Or, of course, the Bible tells us about this false peace. But you see, th this is coming from the projection again. This guy's fixing up the projector lens. And what's pretty interesting is just before that, you see this shot here. We're briefly shown. It was like with that Lady Gaga performance the, uh, that we exposed on Round Saturn's I main channel. I did a video the, just the other day where she had the inverted swastika sun wheel on her forehead and how it related to opening the third eye. So this is what this is showing here, this projector guy, this is the projectionist in the theatre and he, you see how he attaches this wheel and spins it backwards and it's to do with turning this projection on and now showing Queen of Heaven and it's all part of this projected world again. You see, she's, she's an illusion, an illusionist, just like with the Jezebel spirit. Uh, it all ties in together, this false cracking open of the Matrix, this illusion coming to Earth from the Queen of Heaven, um, which is not, you know, Mary is, is the true mother of Jesus, but this is not the same Mary. This is the Catholic Mary, which is uh, Isis. So this whole video... Shame, shame I can't really show too much of it. This whole video is about him coming in on this New Age taxi. Uh, coming in from the East. This great deception coming in from the East with these false gods. Uh, we start off with a red flag so you already know there's something wrong with it. So basically he comes in on this New Age taxi with all this New Age symbology and this false religion of the fallen angels coming from the East. The sun rising in the east. So as he's being taxied in on this New Age bus, you see varying references building up throughout the video showing this Queen Queen of Heaven figure, this Kali figure. You see these, they're looking into this box here and you can see it's part of like, like a kaleidoscope, like a fractal thing, like a projection coming from a different realm. They keep referencing this paint, which again is is the manicured reality. They're, they're all dancing about in this paint. Alluding to cracking open uh, the Matrix. Look at that. Just a quick reference to the Devil Horns. It shows you where this is coming from. This is Luciferian. This is devilish. It's the, the deception. It's the great deception that's coming upon the world. It looks really pretty, it looks really good to the eyes, but unfortunately it is a false sign of wonder. It's a masquerade, a Satan masquerading as light. So all through this we're seeing this big party, this throwing about of these colours and paint, and then back to that wheel again as he goes into the projector room to watch this movie. And he's spinning the wheel backwards, like the backwards swastika, as I said to do with Callie, and... That also is an allusion to, well, if you turn a key backwards, you're unlocking something. So it's like that, that they refer to the third eye as the rolling stone. And also it's anti-clockwise. So it's against, it's anti the beginning and the end, the Alpha and the Omega, Jesus Christ, the Messiah. So this is completely anti-Christ. And it's to do with self-ascension to unlocking the third eye to bring this projected new age reality upon the earth. So you can see, he goes in, look at his top, I mean, 
it's all kaleidoscope. So Lady Fatima in the projector room with the projection and he's talking about, singing about in this song, put your wings on me uh, when I was so thirsty. A thousand points of light. And just this throwing about of colours all over the place. Uh, coming, being broadcast through this television, we've done a lot of exposure on this, on the main Round Saturn's Eye channel, and, and how the technology came from the Matrix, um, and this projection coming upon the Earth, the propaganda of this Antichrist, IHS, Isis Horus set, this unholy trinity, and then she sings this new song, like a lullaby, like this team Antichrist, just indoctrinating and taking over the world through this projection. She's singing this lullaby with these mantras. This Eastern religion deception. And that's not designed to be offensive towards any particular area of the world because uh, from, I've got, an, for example, I've got an Indian friend who says that Christianity is actually the biggest uh, belief system over there. But this is a religion of the fallen angels. And that's why they promote it. And then she starts singing about she's going to shoot across the sky. Look, all the projection keeps showing, referencing the projector now outside. It's not in the movie theatre anymore. Uh, this is showing this projecting this. Oh, it's projecting her outside. She's going to shoot across the sky, and we've got these fireworks. Again, manicured reality, counterfeit, uh, the Queen of Heaven, and this great deception of false light. God bless you guys.